Chase, I have to warn you that takeoff is extremely uncomfortable. I think I can handle it, Professor. I've seen the movies. And launching in 10, 9. <laughs> We do that in case the astronauts change their mind. Hey, what do you know? In space, you can hear them scream. Well done! You are in outer space! Now, to get to the moon will take almost 10 seconds. Oh, okay, you're about the moon now. What? Uh, yeah, it's really close and very small. But don't tell anyone, it's a secret. Now, it's time for your spacewalk. You need to prepare very carefully. I want you to check and recheck your suit before you exit the command module. <laughs> sure thing, Professor. <laughs> That's weird. I don't feel any lighter. I bet it's because of those cookies I ate in the rocket. Oh. 
Lego City selected as destination. Disengaging shield. Launching in five, four, three. I hope you're strapped in safely. One. Blackwell, we're going home. No! I will not return to that society of blinkered fools! I tried building something truly wonderful for them. A self-contained world which they'd never have to leave. An utopian habitat that catered to their every whim and desire. It was a monument to my genius. You were a great man once, Blackwell. But you've gone crazy. Crazy! Your monument was nothing more than an apartment block with a shopping mall. Turn us around. Sorry. <laughs> We're locked in. Bring her over here. Chase! That's pretty low of you, Blackwell. Threatening a lady. Oh, no, no, no. I would never hurt a lady. I just want her to watch you get squashed. Hey there, McCain. Thanks so much for getting me this from the museum. <laughs> wow, that has literally come back to bite me. Whoa, that was close. Be careful. We'll need those energy tanks to run my moon base. No, you do, do ya?
chase. Be quiet. Don't just sit there like a lemon, Rex. Get him! Rex. This way, Kowalski. Where you going, Blackwell? But regrettably, you pair are still in one piece. Although, I'm happy to report that I don't think that will be the case for long. Oh, but don't worry. Everyone important is safe in the command module with me. Along with billions of studs worth of gold. So really, this is just a setback, a minor inconvenience. Hey, quit throwing people at me! You see, once the command module is safely back on the ground, I will begin anew. 
I will gather my resources and rebuild my empire somewhere else. Stop it! And then I will destroy Lego City! And I'll make Natalia watch as I do so. Bon voyage, Chase McCain! Uh, sir? What is it? Can't you see I'm gloating? The parachutes won't open, and we can't get to the emergency release lever. What? Wait there! I'll look for something to help in this cupboard. But that's the escape pod. Yes, it is! <laughs> Can you tell me, how do I get the doors to that? Natalia, are you all right? Where are you? I'm fine. What? Hurry up! The other person has been disconnected and will crash into the ground in three minutes. Please hang up and dial again. Natalia!
good, Dad. We can't reach the parachute release. Excuse me. Did anyone order a hero? Chase! Pull that lever! This lever? Okay. What is it? The brakes. Uh-oh. Professor Kowalski's on his way. He said the command module will touch down any minute now. And what about the tons of falling debris from the rocket? Don't worry, Chief. I've got you covered. The debris splashed down at sea, Marion. Mind if I park here? Oh, oh, there they are! Congratulations. You've done it again, Chase. Almost. Blackwell got away in an escape pod, and Rex, well, he got away too, I uh... Rex? <laughs> Rex isn't a problem. Oh? He crashed headfirst through someone's roof ten minutes ago. Get this off of me! <laughs> hey, Rex, you don't look very flushed with success. I, uh... Ah, I thought you should get the arrest this time. You know what? You can have it, Chief. Some things are more important than work. Oh. Yeah, you're talking about video games, right? I hope the chief notices that I changed my hair today. It'll make being bald all last week worthwhile. 